how the world will be tomorrow will be determined by what kind of mothers you have today. Unfortunately, women also getting as stupid as men. Today, many women in our modern society are stepping out and having a career. And I just like to know, what do you think of this, of women stepping out, being career people, managing home as well, being financially independent? Is this good? Say, every woman should do what she wants to do as an individual person. It should not be made into a trend in a society or the only right thing to do in the world. Because I think if, if a woman is, intends to have two children and raise them, I think it's a full-time job. I'm not saying she should not go out and work. If she wishes to, as an individual person, she's free to do what she wants to do. But having two children is not about reproduction. You are manufacturing the next generation of people. How the world will be tomorrow will be determined by what kind of mothers you have today, believe me. So, why is it… Con you know, I have seen many ladies coming to me and say, when I ask, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just a housewife. I said, why do you say you're just a housewife? You… you don't seem to understand the significance of, you know, being able to nurture two or three new lives, it's not… it's not a not important job. It's a very important job. I have to say this, you know my… my mother never any, said anything much. She never went about telling me I love you or you love me or anything of this kind. It's just that she simply lived. And we, it never occurred to us whether she loves us, she doesn't love us, such questions never came because her whole life was dedicated to us, you know? We know she lived for us, she never said it once, but that's all it is. And I cannot imagine that part of my life without her being around. It is just that she never played an active role in what I am, but the background that she set without the ambience that she set for me, I would never be what I am, for sure. Whatever else may be within me, still the soil that she set around me, without ever interfering with who I am, what I am, just the ambience she set around me and the effort she took to set that ambience, she gave her life to set that ambience, knowing fully well it will play out somewhere. And why does anybody think this is not an important job? In my life, I feel what she did is the most important thing she did to me. And one of the most important things that have happened to me is early life, you never had to think about anything. It was simply she made sure the background was simply always there without a single thought about it. Unconcerned about what's happening around you is what gave me the possibility of sitting with my eyes closed for days on end. Otherwise this wouldn't be possible, I'm saying. <laughs> so. Career, I want you to understand, right now because we've made the whole world into economics, unfortunately women also getting as stupid as men, as if how much money you earn is going to determine the value of your life. No, it is just procurement of things that you need, money is just about that. Man was procuring, woman was taking about the more beautiful aspects of life. Now woman also wants to procure, if there is such an economic need in the family, fine, she must do it. But it is not a compulsive need, it must not be set up as something better to do than doing something if she sings song, if she, if she plays music or if she just loves her children or if she cooks beautifully or she just lives beautifully like a flower. It's good enough, I'm saying. It is not necessary that only if she earns this much money, she is, her, she is doing something valuable, otherwise she's not. If there is an economic need, she can do it or if she has a passion for doing it, she can do it. But let not such values be set up in the world because you are not evolving, you are regressing. You are making survival more important than aesthetics of life. Mm. <laughs>